Hey! hey! Happy Saturday. Happy third Saturday. We are now doing the virtual guided session on the first and third Saturdays of the month. If you're brand new, welcome. If you've been with us for a while, welcome. I'm Shannon. I'm Matt. And we're going to play tunes at not too fast a pace. Mm -hmm. A lot of standard tunes, a couple of gems, mm -hmm. a couple of unusual gems, uh, and hopefully play with all of you. So thanks for joining us in our home. You're very welcome here to Arthur. Happy to have you joining us. It has been a while. And to Tom in California. Hello and welcome back, friends. To Marco and Jeanette in uh, Milano. Hello and welcome. Ciao to you. And Gabriela in Germany. Hi, welcome. Hi, Ted in Ottawa and Jaden in the Netherlands. Hi, Jennifer in Michigan. Hello, Agnieszka in Poland. Aga, welcome, my friend. Hello, Claudia in Chicago. Good to see you again. Margie in Minneapolis also eager to play i'm excited mm -hmm. to play always yeah. i still like to play after all this time it's a good it's, it's fortunate <laughs> fell in southern california hi and welcome russ hi in virginia i'm glad that you have company over i hope you have a great time and um great to have them join us too for a moment hi to the company hey, company <laughs> and to mike in ohio glad that you're joining us even if you're not playing hope you're back to playing soon and just listening is a great thing to do as well Hi, Mike in Oregon. Good to see you again. Yes, indeed. Starting to look and feel like autumn. You can see I have on my jacket, back to school jacket. To Julie in Tennessee. Hi, Bill in San Francisco. Great to hear you on the banjo. Now, that is very rude to show people the bottom of your foot, of I your show shoe. I was just showing I was wearing my slippers. Well, but that's not something that we do in this family. That is not it polite. Is it's that's not thing. polite. No, it's not. Sorry. Um, excuse me to all of the Thai people that Matt just did that. That was gross. Maria in the UK, hello, and thank you for helping us change the conversation back to the welcomes. Frank in Austria, glad you're joining us live. How exciting. And to Shane, my friend, hope all is going well with the flute in the north of Ireland. To Wayne in the peg, glad to have you again. Johnny in LA, and to Yuri in Finland, oh, I'm so glad that you're joining us live as well. Hi, Doug in Athens. Hi to Leanne in Maine, chilly in Maine, I'm sure. It's always like 25 degrees colder up there. Mm -hmm. Hi, Lynn in Connecticut. David, hi and welcome. Katrina, hi, welcome back. Claire, nice to see you joining us from Ireland. And to Andrew in Minnesota as well, you are all very welcome. We're going to get started with Haste to the Wedding, the tune anyway. Carrie, hi and welcome. And before we get started, I'll show you a little tiny piece of our sound check here. Mm. Was our sound check? <laughs> yep, it was going pretty well. We thought that was worth screenshotting, so. That's my so, new profile picture. Yes, and I think that's really how you should remember us always. <laughs> so here we go. Without further ado, haste to the wedding, not too fast. <laughs> that's it. GF. That's an unusual little beginning. So if you don't know this tune already, the beginning is la do 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 da da da. If that's all you get, that's great. One, two, here we go. Woo!
ends on D. Really settles on D. Really is in D, even though it starts on an A note. This mm. is really in the key of D. So usually the last note or the place where it really settles usually is the key that it's in, mm. right? The key that um, it's based around. So very nice. Carrie, i um, glad that you are joining us for that fun discussion. It's good for people in Florida to be talking about key signatures as yeah. well as in Boston. We are all one key signature. <laughs> Um, and um, Andrew, that's cool that that was the first fiddle tune you learned. I have to say, I'm disappointed that Arthur is the only one who weighed in on that horrid um, picture, uh, that that still frame from our sound check. Very funny. I think yeah, we, okay. that should we'll be just, an album we'll just cover. Keep showing it until people notice it. <laughs> <laughs> and Sean, hello, Captain Tokyo. Good to have you join us, Saul in Michigan. Hello and welcome, Frank. Frank you got married, you got on, married Monday? on Monday. Congratulations. Congratulations to Frank. Cheers. Our best wishes Super to you. Yay. Christian, hi and welcome. Really great to hear you posting those beautiful, um, that beautiful tune, the um, composition of Jerry Holland mm. on the Facebook page. And Bill, those banjo jigs were great. Uh, the banjo reels were great. Um, and folks, if you aren't already a member of the Virtual Guided Session Facebook page, we're really trying to keep this uh, private for our community so you can feel comfortable to share practice videos and such. Mm -hmm. um, so make sure to respond to the membership questions. We are ruthless about the membership questions. <laughs> Just because, you know, sometimes bots or people out outside yeah, yeah, like yeah, try to yeah, become weird. members and we just want to keep it safe yeah and be and on the flip side if you are you if a, a number of new people have joined the facebook group and i suspect some of them have not been to a virtual guided session before so if you're you know on the facebook page and this is your first time tuning in hi hey hey, hey. and yo hey hi welcome back good to have you um we're gonna carry on friends with some reels yeah. father kelly's that's in in harmony in the in harmony collection if you have it <laughs> into the ash plant I think that's in my book oil for the chain hmm. but these are common core selections so our friend Clayton put together the VGS DB virtual guided session database with all the tunes that we play here really nice service so <coughs> here we go these are both common core tunes not too fast Also, I feel like that was almost too fast.
Slinky. Slightly spy. Yeah. Slightly spy. Yeah. If you were around for the last virtual guided session on the first Saturday of the month, you would have heard Matt's uh, creepy tango from oh, that's your right. surf album. So mm -hmm. I felt like that was the spy. Mm -hmm. You know, on a surf mm -hmm. album, you got to have like a like a, a Latin-y thing yeah, and a little yeah. spy-y thing. So there you yeah, go. Yeah, kind yeah. of full circle round here. <laughs> very nice. Very mm -hmm. nice. Um, and very nice. Congratulations again to Frank. Lovely having folks uh, be supportive and weigh in and give their well wishes. And to Margaret, hi and welcome. Thanks for joining us again. And John, hi, and a belated hi to Julie if she tunes in later. Glad that she's in this at the squeeze in. And Tauno, how wonderful that you made us live and you, you're joining us live. We're really happy to have you. And uh, you posted a video on the Facebook page of the Balafad Polka. And I think that is what we're going to do next. So we had chosen that as our name your tune selection. I posted a kind of tutorial video and Tauno, you were the first one to learn it. So great. We'll play that right now. And um, to uh, Tina in Dublin, glad you're joining us live as well. Wonderful to have you. And folks who are joining us live but aren't on the chat, we're welcome. You're all mm -hmm. very welcome and happy to have you. Jim, hi in North England. That's right. You're there now and hope you're having a good time and glad you're joining us as well. So, um, Allison, hey, hey, I hope um, you're enjoying your out-of-town guests, and I hope that your hand is healing as well. And Elena, yes, a slinky tempo indeed. We're going for slinky. Slinky mm. is a good idea because it implies not rushed and kind of easy going. I like this. Very good. So, polkas, you can't do too slowly, though. So, we're going to do the Balnafad polka mm. and the owl palette. So, our friend Anna, in a, at a live gig... Um, our friend Anna came uh, in Virginia. We mm -hmm. were playing in Virginia, and Anna came, and she brought us the sweetest thing ever, um, this wonderful little pouch to hold owl pellets that we find. And there's even an owl feather, a little owl feather in here. <gasps> oh, it's so sweet. So it's next to Jane the owl, for whom this next tune is named. Uh, the owl pellet polka I wrote some time ago. So we'll Wait. try those two. Who is it named for? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Uh, All right. Die, da, 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 dee, 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 la, one, two, here we go.
and hey Adele you snuck in hello and welcome to our home so glad to have you tuning in from Halifax and joining us for tunes and Maria I think you got a welcome earlier but just in case welcome again and to Berta hello and welcome glad to have you joining us from Hungary Kusinem. and to Larry I'm so sorry that your cork gave way no big deal of course an easy fix okay. um it's okay uh, you can get that kind of reattached uh -huh. ideally by somebody who really knows what's what but at the end of the day i think they just kind of can re-glue it mm -hmm. or glue on new cork mm -hmm. but it's still alarming when something is happening with your instrument yeah, so yeah, nobody likes that Wishing you a speedy, speedy resolution to that a speedy problem. Yeah, speedy recorking. And to Lynn, hello and welcome. Yes, that owl pellet polka. I think Jennifer was the one who thought of the owl pellet, uh, kind of mentioned it. And um, so that was a fun challenge. Back That was one of the first tunes that I wrote back in the day with the VGS gang. <laughs> Written many to commemorate many funny occasions, including one coming up today. Maria, you had a hand in that. Uh, foreshadow. Mm -hmm. But first... Some jigs. Some jigs. Swallowtail. And da 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 do dee do da Irishman's heart to the ladies. And then we're gonna end with the fly in the porter. And this is a great three-part tune that we learned at the Zoom classes. Boy, we had a lot of people working really hard on this tune, and I think we got it. So we're going to give it a go. Mm. And Matthew, remember this joke about the fly and the beer? Sure. Can you tell it? Oh. Please. The, well, yeah, okay. So, so fly in the porter. Porter is a dark, uh, dark roast of dark, beer. Dark beer, yeah. <laughs> the, uh, the the one of the classic, you know, classic genre of uh, insulting different nationalities. Um, but there's uh, what is it? A, a, a oh, I can't even remember. There's a Scottish guy and a, a, an Irish guy and an English guy, uh, and they're sitting in the bar. And uh, wouldn't you know, three flies land in each of their beers. And the English guy takes his beer and takes a look at it and he's like, "Oh, that's disgusting, barman! Give me a new, give me a new beer. I need a new beer." Flies then, do carry can carry disease. Yeah, mm -hmm. Irish guy, uh, Irish guy takes the takes a look at it and you know pulls the fly out and tosses it over his shoulder and goes, you know, starts drinking. And Scottish guy gets it and he takes a look at the thing and he grabs the fly and he says, "Spit it out! Spit it out!" Yeah. Yeah. So there you go. <laughs> Swallowtail. See, we can't hear you laughing, but I know you are. <laughs> <laughs> They're laughing like when you show them the bottom of your foot. <laughs> da, 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 da. What was that? Try it again. Ready? This was our sound check earlier. <laughs> that is a still frame from our sound check. No, don't do that. In... <laughs> okay. One, two, here we go.
great tune. Great tunes, all three. I love the change into the second, into the A major one, into the um, Irishman's Heart as well. Mm. <clears throat> It's all about Good. that. All about that and I platform. hope it worked out for you. I hope the fly in the porter worked out for those of you who learned this tune recently. That was a lot of fun to do. Love the bills, giving the hop emojis, and a lot of people laughed at your joke or laughed at our faces or both. Mm. Very, very good. Good, good, good. Um, and even Jim thought it was funny, and he's an ex Scott. There so there go. you go. Um, well done. And Robert and Susan in Tennessee love that joke. So there you go. It's keeper. Yes. Mm. Um, Doug, thanks for also laughing. So Steve in Pennsylvania, so glad to have you here and so glad that you are on the mend. Mm. Um, good, good. And wish you a full recovery quite soon. And hi to Karen and Charlie Bird. Charlie, happy National Pet Day. Pet Bird Day. Happy National Pet should, Bird Day, my should, friend. We should text Gina. We Who should. Knew? Who, knew? Who knew? Oh, that's good. We should. We will. Mm. And Julie and Wes. Salut in Paris. Good evening. Thanks for joining us on the road. So you're in Paris. Um, just in case you haven't located a session to go to tonight. Anybody know of any good doings in Paris tonight? Good Irish music doings? How exciting. Got a flute player and a fiddle player on the move. That's mm -hmm. very exciting. Thanks for taking the time to check in from the road. And... Um, Let's see. Claudia, um, good, good. You're playing of Fly in the Porter needs some work. That's okay. So does mine. I mean, so we all need work. Um, but it only starts just by doing it, right? Just by doing the work. So way to go. Mm -hmm. And um, yay, Claire, that you liked the Selman Rose episode. It was a really neat one, huh? I'm working on an episode right now about rare library finds. Huh? In just in case you think that. No, it's like riveting. It's really, really fun. And I even say the full name of Bangkok at the end of the episode. If we listen to the very nice end, you'll trip. hear me say the full name of Bangkok. Maybe I'll even do it today if it comes up. <laughs> <laughs> I had to remember, you know, you have to, um, in Thailand, uh, like on school exams, sometimes you have to write the full name of Bangkok been a long time so I had to actually review it so I did I have it right here it's all written out in case you want to say it along with me there it is um there we go and Vivian I'm glad you made it happy to have you whenever you can join us so wonderful that you're here we're going to carry on with some reels um Jackie Coleman's Jackie Coleman's and the pigeon on the gate and the pigeon on the gate mm, these are two common core tunes two goodies if you don't know these tunes they'd be good ones to know because yeah. probably a lot of people know them yep out and about. All right, so da -de -do -da -da -de -do -da 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 in D. It starts on a D pickup note B A la do do la da dum into da la da do do de do de do la de do 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 dum. Don't be playing a different tune while I'm trying to sing it for the nice people with the nice people. Here we nope. go. <laughs> da just stick to the jokes. Yeah, okay, okay. okay. Yeah. Da do do da la do 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 da da. Here we go.
just getting the three blind mice there. <laughs> all the air is gone now. <laughs> I used up all my air. I was just talking about that with somebody about really using the air to the last moment, and it does sometimes then lend the tone and the music a little energy. If you just play through to the very end, you're kind of out of air, that but not totally great. out. That sounds like a delightful thing to do. <laughs> And on that note, yeah. let's play the humors of Tully Krein mm. and Mickey O'Callaghan's. So I don't think that Garode is here today, so you'll have to see it on the replay, my friend. But I, uh, you recommended these tunes. You requested these tunes last time around. Mm. I had to look it up for a second, but now I remember it's the... <laughs> that one. Mm -hmm. The and humors of Tully Krein. Into the one that goes after it, the G. <laughs> So um, I don't know what that tune is called, but um, Garod called it Mickey Callahan's or Mickey O'Callahan's. I think this is the right one. It's a good huh. one anyway. It's what I call. Um, did I type them in the chat? I did not type them in the not chat. Yet, not yet. Mm. But it's because I have the name of Bangkok mm -hmm. on the brain. Yeah, Do you know, nice. friends, the, the formal name of Bangkok, like in Thai, is very, very, very long. That's what You're I'm really talking about. I'm, I'm saying, I'm, I'm letting people know to get them excited for the Irish Music Stories podcast episode coming out on Tuesday with the full name of Bangkok. Mm. <clears throat> okay. Um, do, do, da, da, da. So, Fel, you should learn it too, meaning the humors of Tully Crine or the full name of Bangkok. Yeah. Let us know. Either, both. <laughs> do, la, de, do, la, de, dum, da, 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 da. One, two, here we go. <laughs> Very nice tune. Like very them very nice much, tune. Shannon. Like them very much. Thank you. Yes, me um, too. Yeah. 
think it's time. Yeah, is it I time think it's time. time. So okay. Maria, last week, well, everybody, last week, we oh. were um, talking about the Ospreys that I had encountered with my friend Ellery Klein and how they have this amazing swooping, like a distinctive flap, and then they soar when they're heading down to get a fish. Mm -hmm. And uh, Maria, you came up with the Osprey Strathspey. So I have done it. I've written the Othspray. The Othspray. Can you say that? Othspray. Yes. It's a lot of fun. Um, so this, friends, is the pass the hat uh, portion of the of the session. Uh, we will put a couple of, of, of uh, PayPal tip jar links in there if you'd like <laughs> to throw something in the in the hat. It is much appreciated um, because the the bar doesn't pay. No, just, um, but we yeah. So it obviously no no obligation, but it is um, it is greatly appreciated. Yes, and we're also and we're just really happy that you're here and happy to have you supporting one another in your practice of Irish music wherever you are, and to play these tunes not too fast. Yeah. Um, you know, to kind of celebrate their beauty and to make them maybe slightly accessible. Mm -hmm. um, we are not going to play slowly now, though. No. This so is this is this is the so the the off spray is a a world premiere, and then we're going to go into two other tunes of Shannon's, three peats in a pod, and the brown weasel. So, away we go, Shannon. This may be the first Strathspey played on the uh, on the session too. No. No, it's not. Never mind. One, two. <laughs> just missed all of the kind of like little tiny bits I want to go again okay I'm sorry you need a more one sorry friends one two better now <laughs> Thank you. 
Hey. hey, there you go. Um, so hopefully, you know, the osprey got to swoop down and get some fish. Got mm -hmm. it? Don't spray the osprey. Ah, the off spray. Okay, that was fun. Nice. I liked it. I liked it very uh, much. <coughs> yeah, joyful, joyful. Yeah. And I'm glad we kind of did a beast. We did a we did it again. Mm -hmm. It was probably a good idea. And Arthur, oh. thank you for giving ideas to Julian West for sessions in Paris. Wonderful. And thanks for the swoopy, uh, lovely thoughts there folks glad you enjoyed the tune and glad you got to see the alt steve wonderful and uh Seems what else what else is going see on see if here? the alt can do the, the off spray <laughs> see if they can say it so yeah. next up we're going to do some jigs oh, some jigs and i love this jig so john McHughes is what i call it McHughes. McHughes. um it's also called adam and eve and it goes <laughs> First 50. Yeah, indeed. I think I called it McHughes in first 50. And then we'll go into a common core tune that is much loved and we haven't done it. Um, very often. Uh, the Calliope House. And Dat, I'll tell you a little bit more about Thailand after this. Dum, do, 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 da, do, 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 da. So one, two, here we go. Richardson there. 
Lovely, lovely. And um, that, the reason that I studied Thai music in Thailand was first, I was not there to study Thai music. I was there to just be in school. I was 16 and I was plopped into school there and, you know, just the general curriculum, um, expecting to know the full name of Bangkok in Thai. And I really didn't speak Thai. And um, so taking music classes was a way to at least be able to communicate with people without knowing the language at first. And as a result, you know, when you study Thai music, you get a chance to learn some very beautiful old songs with gorgeous old, old fashioned words, you know, beautiful old vocabulary words. So as a result, not only did I learn the Thai language, um, but I really did learn a lot of gorgeous poetic language as well. Um, so love Thai music. I would not call me a real great practitioner of Thai uh, classical music, um, but I play a bit of Sao and have learned to sing some of the songs from the great master Ajahn Jirapon Lekpong in Supanburi in Thailand. And I also know the full name of Bangkok. Um, and I'm going to do it right now. Okay. Okay, here we go. Because I got to say this for the podcast. Okay, I have to read it though. Krung Thep Mahana Khon Amon Ratanakosin Mahin Tara Ayutthaya Mahadi Lok Pop Noparat Ratatani Buri Rom Udom Ratani Wet Maha Satan Amon Piman Amon Piman Awata Satit. Let me do that again. Amon Piman Awata Satit. Sakatatia Wisanu Gam Prasit. There we go. You're going to have to work on it. Again, tune in on Tuesday and you'll hear that done even more clearly because I have reviewed it now. But that's a good way to review some history of Thailand and stuff. Yep. So here you go in case you need it yep. and you want to follow yep. along. There it is. Um, okay, who made your great sounding bazooki and Davey what are you Stewart. going to be doing with the bazooki soon? Yeah, well, Davy Stewart made this made this bazooki, Davy Stewart down in New Zealand. And I love it. I've had it for, for a while. When did I get this? 2008 or something? I think something like that. But anyway, good God. Uh, but uh, yes, on the 9th of October, I will be doing a bazooki workshop uh, and on Zoom. So there will be a guitar workshop and a, a bazooki workshop. And, uh, and if you want inter information, info just email me. Yep. If you don't have my email address, yep. you can find a contact through my shannonheatonmusic.com. And, and looky there, looky there, Shannon. Everyone, everyone else thinks that Calliope is an E, too. We had a little, we had a little uh, discussion about that. We never actually, like, looked it up to find out. I said, really. great. Sounds good. Yeah. You, you want said, to do you it said in e? I, You said I was wrong, is what you said. <laughs> okay, maybe we'll do something else in E later on. Maybe. Um, let's play Swinging on a Gate and the Sligo Maid, shall we? Let's do Some nice do. common let's core tunes back, keep it country. Yep. Da, da, dee, is dee, the dum. pigeon swinging on the same gate? Is, a, is it the same gate that the pigeon is on and that we're swinging on? I think there's a lot of gate, and I think it's a hint. Okay. <laughs> uh, we, we have a gate in the backyard I'm supposed to fix. Well, it's more a passive construction. There is a gate in the backyard that needs to be fixed. <laughs> So maybe we'll get to it. Here we go. One, two.
good yeah. tune. And Jennifer, I've heard you play that beautifully. And it was a flute light summer for you. You know, sometimes taking a break or, you know, a little easing off and then coming back strong. It's interesting. I've had, I've had a banjo light summer. We'll see what happens the next time I pick it up. Yeah, it's interesting to see what settles and mm. what kind of needs to be reimagined. Or maybe she means it was a flute light summer. Like you put a light on your flute to like, you know, oh, yeah. the light on your keys to yeah. see. Like, can't I, see the book very well. Yeah, flute you know, light. All, the, all the, all the, the, the fiddle players put those <laughs> LED things on their bows. Yeah, we got to get a... <laughs> oh, my gosh, it's someone time. Someone was asking, wait, real quick, someone... Uh, so there was... Uh, bazooki thing. Someone was asking about... Um, playing in, in my, like A minor without a capo. Um, that was a good example of stuff I would do, uh, A minor without a capo. And the, the, the overall uh, thing is just don't play the notes that don't fit. There you go. There you go. And do that face. Wait, wait, what's the, the face? Oh, the I face. think here's the face. Do that face. Yeah, when in is. doubt, do that yeah, face. That'll do it. That'll do it. <laughs> All right. Oh, and Dad, there is a beautiful <clears throat> flute culture in Thailand. Indeed, the Kluwe, Kluwe Thai is so pra, lei, so beautiful. Um, so Westering Home, we're going to end with Westering Home. And next time that we meet, we will play hop jigs for Jennifer. Mm. Um, what should you learn? Learn the boys of Balasadere. We'll do that one. I love that one. Mm. Um, let's do promenade mm -hmm. and the boys of Balasadere next time. Um, those, that's a great way to start. <clears throat> so, Westering Home is what we're going to end with in the key of D, unless you prefer E. Maybe oh, we'll we go into E. Switch? Maybe we'll switch, I won't, I won't shall we? Um, but before we finish, thanks, folks, for joining us. Thanks for being here. Dankuvel. Guramahagat. Sorry, that was terrible. Dankuvel. Guramahagat. Ta palat. Merci beaucoup. Trugare. Arigato gozaimas. Muchas gracias. Tinkoya. Thank you. Thank you. Mille grazie. Tie, tie. Goi, Valavam, Toda, Tuzentak, Kamsahamida, Efharisto, Valavam, Eskarika Sko, Danyavad, Giros, Natenda, Shukran, Miguech, Yutva, Spasiba, Achehe, Salamat, Tanimakati, Tioch, Kusenem, Mito Brigado, Gam Un, Kopkun, Naka, Kopta Lido. Thanks, everybody, and we'll be back on the first. Saturday of October. That's right, which I think is actually the first, is it not? I think so. Yeah, that's easy to remember. So, be well, and here we go. One, two, three, one.
thanks so much. I don't post the set lists in advance. I don't always come up with the set lists too much in advance, but I will try to do a little bit better about post giving them a little advance warning on the VGS Facebook page. Uh, any questions, you can just get in touch with me through shannonheatonmusic.com. And thanks a lot, everybody. Be so well. Hope to see you before too long. Bye.